What's going on everyone, in front of Fox here, and today I have some special news for you. If you didn't know, a new beta for Call of Duty Mobile dropped for iOS and Android yesterday, and it brought a lot of new features. They finally brought 120 FPS to the iPad M1. I'm so glad that they finally optimized the game for the new iPad. It took them a little while, surprisingly PUBG Mobile optimized before them. But guys, it's finally here. We have 120 frames per second on the iPad Pro M1 2021. Dog is inside! Enemy down! Contact with enemy! Target's inside! Enemy down! Dog is in sight! Need back up! Dog is in sight! Contact with enemy! Sniper! Tango down! Contact with enemy! Enemy contact! Enemy contact! Targets in sight. Enemy UAV spotted. Friendly predator missile inbound. Hostile hunter killer drone inbound. Destroy enemy's hunter killer. Enemy contact. Enemy contact. Enemy contact. UAV recon ready for deployment. Enemy contact. Predator missile on standby. Dog is inside. Target down. Enemy contact. Target down. UAV recon standing by. Repeat. UAV recon standing by. Enemy down! Enemy missile awaiting orders. 
contact with enemy. Dog is in top. Enemy contact. Friendly predator missile found. Enemy contact. Enemy down. I have contact. UAV recon ready for deployment. Objective almost complete. Keep it up. game is finally listening to the community they did what they're supposed to do it only took them about one feedback reddit to kind of like implement what the community was saying i've seen hundreds of people if not thousands say to optimize for the new ipad it wouldn't be logistical to buy a thousand dollar product just for a game not to optimize it developers listen they did what they're supposed to do and i'm proud of that um pubg mobile really looks at the dollar amount when it comes to updates instead of like feedback from the community but cod mobile not only optimized the game they released a bunch of new content they released new score streaks new grenades new ui features they made the game better they didn't just optimize it they made the game better and we have to understand how hard that was because people aren't in the office that much they're working from home. They're working on a delayed schedule. So for COD Mobile to do all of this in a month's time, it's, it's amazing. And I will always be proud of COD Mobile for that. If you've made it to the end of the video, congrats. Thank you for watching. And hopefully we get this update sometime this week or next week. It's still in the beta, but it's pretty much finished. They said we should get it in season six or seven, but who knows? Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.